Hello you guys, it's Charlotte, welcome back. Tonight we're doing some self-care. We love a good self-care night. For the past couple of weeks, I've just been feeling really stressed out. I feel like I've been spending a lot of time on my computer and on my phone, so my eyes are really tired. It's the middle of winter, so my skin is really dry. And overall, I'm just like desperately in need of a good self-care night. So that's what we're doing tonight. No better way to spend a Saturday night than doing some self-care and relaxation. All right, so it's currently about 6 p.m. right now, and I'm gonna start off my self-care evening by doing a little bit of exercise. I started a new Chloe Tang challenge, so I'm on day six of that one. I'll be putting out a video on that once I have completed the challenge, so keep an eye out for that one. It'll be coming probably like mid-March. So I'm gonna get changed into some workout clothes and get started on my self-care evening with my workout. I am done with my workout. I always feel so much better after I work out. Just nice to like get the endorphins flowing and move your body, get your blood flowing, all that good stuff. I used to really not like working out, but now it's okay. Now I kind of like it. <laughs> so now that I'm done with my workout, I am gonna go take a shower. I've been using the same shampoo and conditioner for a couple of months now, so I think my hair is kind of getting used to it and it's not really doing its job anymore. So I think I'm going to switch to a new shampoo and conditioner tonight. So I'll show you guys all of the products that I use and I'll tell you how the new ones work. See if they're any good, if they work any better than the ones that I'm currently using, but I'm gonna go take a shower. <laughs> Here we are right now, no longer 17. Oh. Have we been around? Got some years on us, and a new bell as a sea. So we're here, that are still up here inside your dream land. Wind that are still up here inside your sleep. And does he know about our time inside your ramp cycle? And that I'm on the way when the night goes. All right guys, I'm out of the shower and I'm really liking the way that my hair is drying with the new products that I put in it. You guys saw from the footage, I used the BioSilk Trio of shampoo, conditioner, and then like, not really a hair mask, but kind of like a leave-in mousse maybe, I guess? Leave-in treatment um, for after. I just kind of comb that through my hair. And first of all, it smells so good. It smells like fresh flowers and like fresh laundry. 
which is just like such a nice scent to have on my <laughs> in my hair um, but it's also I feel like it's drying really nice and it's my hair is definitely not like as staticky as it normally is in the winter so we'll see if that continues to work out but the next thing that I'm gonna do for my little self-care evening is clean up my room a little bit because it was just kind of a hectic week, busy week, and I really want to clean up a little bit so when I wake up tomorrow, I'm just like in a good headspace and I can have a good Sunday. And so I won't have to start off next week with a messy room. So I am going to pick up my clothes off the floor and get organized. Okay, so my room is all clean now, yay! Except for my towel, I need to go put that in the laundry. So it's a super chill Saturday night at my house, as you guys could probably guess. So I'm going to go make a really cozy, like comfort food style dinner. I'm so excited, we're gonna do just like a vat of spaghetti with I think Alfredo sauce and ground beef. That just sounds really good to me right now, so I'm gonna go make that. I am back from dinner. It was so good. Definitely the right thing to scratch that like comfort food craving itch. And now I'm going to do a little bit of journaling. Not a lot, but just a little. Self-care for the mind, if you will. So I have this book here. It's called Present Not Perfect. And it's a journal for slowing down, letting go, and loving who you are. Um, I got this a couple of years ago and I am going to do like a page or two in this. Hopefully that will um, help me kind of like relax my mind and slow down and kind of like take my mind off of school and work and like all the things that are stressing me out about life right now and I can kind of just be like focus a little bit more on the things that I have, what I should be grateful for, that kind of thing. So I am going to pick out a couple of prompts. So I found this prompt and I really, really like it. Let's see if I can get it to focus. There it is. It says, time seems to pass too quickly. Stop and take a snapshot of this moment. Describe what's happening within you and around you. And what do you want to remember most about this moment? Been set free by his words, I still can't take it. Oh, what a scandal! What's been given to me, I can't grasp it. But a change of heart, a change of heart is what you find. Perfect. Okay, so I just finished filling out those prompts, and I actually do feel pretty good and more like present in the moment, which is really kind of cool maybe this is something that I will do more of in the future when I'm getting kind of like overwhelmed or just like into a bad mental headspace 
Um, I wrote about my YouTube and how much I really just enjoy filming, editing, and making videos and posting them and just like seeing my life basically um, in such a different way because it is so different to like live it day to day and then actually like try to see it how other people might see it. So I just wrote about that and like how special it is to me and how much I really do enjoy it. So that was, yeah, that was actually really fun. Okay, so it's currently 9.49, it's almost 10 p.m. And I'm getting pretty tired and I'm starting to feel that like eye strain that I've been feeling all week. I've been wearing my blue light glasses. I put both my phone and my computer onto like night shift mode, which is supposed to like reduce blue light and kind of make it easier on your eyes. But I don't know if you guys can really see because the lighting isn't great, but my under eye circles are getting pretty bad. And I even popped a blood vessel in this eye at some point in the past few days. My eyes just like hurt, so I am going to try something I've never done before, but I <laughs> I'm just going to like see how it goes. The age old cartoon remedy of putting cucumbers <laughs> on your eye, cucumber slices like over your eyes and just like seeing if it actually works. So I just have some like cut up thin slices of cucumber here and I'm just going to sit back here so they don't fall off my eyes and try it out. I'm not gonna be able to see, so I'm gonna try to hold the camera as steady as possible. They were in the fridge for a little while, so they're like nice and cool. I don't know if I'm, there we go. Oh no. Oh gosh, I have to be leaning back so far. This is not quite as relaxing as I thought. Can you even see? Is the camera even pointed at my face anymore? I can't tell if this feels good or not. <laughs> I might need to lay down <gasps> a bit more. Okay. There we go. How do I look? Feels kind of good. Feels kind of weird though. I feel like it's like burning but cold. And I can't tell if that's because of the cucumber or if that's because they've been sitting in the fridge. Or if it's like the juices dripping into my eyes. Okay, this doesn't feel good. Ow! How do we look? Do I look refreshed? <laughs> Ow! That kind of hurt. My poor eyeballs. Ow. Do they look red? <gasps> I think that was bad for my eyes. Uh, uh oh. That did not feel good. I imagine that feeling so good in my head and that did not feel good. Look at this. Can you even see? This eye is tearing up. <gasps> look at my eyes. <gasps> Did I just ruin my eyes with cucumbers? All right, you guys, on that note, <laughs> with my burning eyes, I'm gonna call it a day on my self-care night. Thank you guys so much for spending the night with me if you made it this far. Make sure you subscribe to my channel down below if you haven't already, like this video, and leave me a comment because I love chatting with you guys in the comments. But that is it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time. Update, I put the cucumber back on my eyes and just let it sit, let the sting wear off, and they actually felt so good. So um, what I actually highly recommend, I fell asleep with them on my eyes so it was very relaxing. <laughs>